Good morning children. How are you? Welcome to my mathematic class and I am sure and I hope that you are sitting with your maths class work and your maths textbook. But today we are not going to learn any new topic. Okay, we are only going to revise everything that we have learned. Okay, first of all, this is our first revision class for the first lesson. So, get ready to answer all my questions and repeat what I say. Okay, do you remember what I had, what are the spellings that I taught you in the first video? Okay. Yes, the spellings of 2D and 3D shapes. What are 2D shapes? Let's quickly revise and then we'll go to the spellings. Okay, what are the 2D shapes? Yes, we are going to revise 2D shapes. Yes, what is this? I'm not going to tell you the spelling. You have to tell me the spelling of this. This is a 2D shape and it is a, tell me what it is. Yes, I can hear you. It is, it's a triangle. How many sides does a triangle have? Triangle has three equal sides. One, two and three. How many corners does a triangle have? Okay, a triangle has three corners. One. 2 and 3. A triangle has 3 equal sides and 3 corners. Okay, next. What is this? Yes. A square. Square is a 2D shape and it has 4 equal sides. 1, 2, 3 and 4. Okay, a square has 4 equal sides and Four corners. One, two, three and four. They are called corners. See here, corners. One, two, three and four. Four corners. A square is a 2D shape. It has four equal sides and four corners. Okay, what is this? Yes, it's a circle. What is this? It's a circle. Shall we spell circle? C-I-R-C-L-E. Circle. Spell again. C-I-R-C-L-E. Circle. Circle is a 2D shape. Shall we spell uh, square? S-Q-U-A-R-E. Square. Spell again. S-Q-U-A-R-E. Square. Okay. Triangle. Let's spell triangle. Do you remember the spelling of a triangle? Okay. T-R-I-A-N-G-L-E. Triangle. T-R-I-A-N-G-L-E. Triangle. Okay. What shape is this? Oh, it's a beautiful wedding card. And what shape is this wedding card? Okay. It's a wedding card. And what shape is the wedding card? Okay. This is a rectangular shape or you can call it a rectangle. Okay, it's opposite sides. See here, this side and this side is equal. The opposite sides of a rectangle is equal. See here, this side is opposite to this side and it's equal. This side is opposite to this side and both are equal. Equal in length. Okay. A wedding card. An example of a rectangle. Shall we spell rectangle? R-E-C-T-A-N-G-L-E. -E. Rectangle. Spell again. R-E-C-T-A-N-G-L-E. -E. Rectangle. Okay. Let's see. What is this? Yes. What shape is this? This is also 2D shape. This is also a beautiful wedding card. Okay. And it is in perfect square shape. See. One, two, three, four. Four equal sides. Four corners. And it's a 2D shape. 
like that so many shapes you can find at home okay spell square again s q u a r e square okay and uh, what about the okay, do you remember some of the 3d shapes that we learned what are the 3d shape tell me quickly cone cube cuboid sphere and cylinder tell again cone cube sphere that, yes tell me cube cuboid sphere cylinder and cone okay name if i tell you if i ask you name a vegetable that is a cone uh, in shape of a cone okay here is a vegetable in the shape of a cone go to the kitchen mummy see this carrot it has a cone shape mama see this ice cream this is in cone shape so it is in cone shape see here this is a cone shape and the vegetable that is in cone shape is a carrot another uh, object that is of a cone shape that is ice cream mm -hmm. ah, yummy you like to eat that ice cream so much okay next what is this okay i told you a round object is a sphere this shape is called round shape is called as sphere wow you just love to play with a round little ball and that is called a spherical shape it has a wow that smiley last time i to show you remember okay what is the spelling of a sphere okay let's spell together s p h e r e sphere spell again s p h e r e sphere okay now quickly tell me what are the objects that are found in spherical in shape at home especially you go to the kitchen you will find lot of spherical vegetables okay ah what is this last time i showed you wow oh, it's a tomato and tomato is in what shape it is in sphere shape let's spell sphere again red beautiful tomato wow beautiful but this is not your toy you know you cannot play with it you just have to go to the kitchen and tell mummy look at this tomato it is spherical in shape sphere s p h e r e sphere s p h e r e sphere okay sphere in shape and what is this last time i okay i showed you onion onion is in what shape yeah almost round like a ball and it is also spherical in shape mummy onion is uh, in sphere shape s p h e r e sphere okay little little objects that you find at home you can go there are lot of 2d shapes and 3d shapes found at home children you should go around check in your house and you will find so many 2d shapes and 3d shapes here i found a little bulb okay it looks so beautiful white bulb okay if you uh, uh, if you it's a light na night lamp and small bulb it is also a spherical shape round shape is called a sphere s p h e r e sphere okay next we are going to and uh, then uh, next i have in my hand what is this yes it's a box it's a beautiful box in the shape of a cuboid what is this and this is a 3d shape and sphere is also a 3d shape and cuboid is a 3d shape and bulb is a small bulb is a 3d shape because it's in sphere shape okay the ball is in what sh what uh, shape 3d shape okay okay now this box is a cuboid in shape okay 
the cuboid has how many faces? Let's see. One, two, three, four, five and six faces. And how many uh, corners it has? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven and eight. Eight corners. A cube and a cuboid. Okay, it has eight corners and six faces. Faces or sides are called as faces. Six faces. One, two. See here. One, one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, six faces and eight corners. Okay, what is this in my hand? Wow. It's a ball. What shape is this? Yes, it's a sphere. Spherical in shape. S-P-H-E-R-E. -E. Ball is a spherical in shape. And it round objects, round things are always, they are in spherical shape. Okay, spherical shape or object. Objects of spherical shape. And what is this? Next one I am going to show you. Wow! This is a box. A cube box. Cuboid. Cube in shape. Okay? Cube in shape. See here? Exactly perfectly. This side is same as this side. And the next side. And the next side. And this side is equal to this side. All four sides have same, same in measurement. And this also has eight corners. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight corners. A cube has eight corners and six faces. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Six faces. Okay. This is how. Okay. One more object I showed you last time. Okay, what is this? A big bottle. Big bottle and what shape is this? This is a cylindrical shape. It's a round, hollow inside. Okay, you can fill it with something. This type of a shape is called as cylindrical shape or shape of a cylinder. See, you go to the kitchen and see your gas cylinder. It is a shape of a cylinder. Okay, that shape, round and a top and a bottom. And see here, there's no corners in this. There's no single sides in this. No faces. Okay, wow. This type of a object, which is round and hollow inside, it's a cylindrical shape. Or shape or an object of cylinder in shape. Okay. And what are the things in your bag uh, that are of cylindrical shape? Cylinder. Yes. Your pencil. Your pencil is a cylindrical in shape. Cylinder. See around. Although it's not hollow inside. But it is round and it is cylindrical in shape. Pencil is a a, an object of 3D uh, shape and it's a cylinder. Shall we spell cylinder? C Y L I N D E R. Cylinder. Once again, C Y L I N D E R. Cylinder. Okay. What is this? Okay. This is also a sketch pen. And sketch pen, beautiful one. Orange color sketch pen. In what shape is this sketch pen? Wow, oh, yes. This is also my sketch pen is in cylinder shape. And it is a shape of 3D shape. This my sketch pen is 3D in shape. And it is a cylinder. It is round. Yes. Cylinder in shape. Its gap is also a cylinder in shape. Okay, cylinder shape. And the sketch pen is also in cylindrical shape. Okay. 
my dear children, we also have learned some of the shapes. Oh, so many objects. Your daddy's handkerchief will be in what shape? Square shape. And your mommy's handkerchief will be in what shape? Huh? It is also in square shape. Perfect. Because all the four sides will be equal. And you can find so many objects that are of 2D and 3D shapes. Okay. And quickly shall we revise. Okay. Shall we re revise the tables? Do you remember the tables? Are you learning tables? Okay. I know. When we very soon dear children. Very soon the lockdown is going to get over. And we are going to start the school. Okay, I know you are waiting to come to school. I am also waiting to go to school. I want to see children. I want to see all of you children. I want to see how you look. I want to see how beautiful you are. And I want to really call you by names. And because of that, we are going to definitely start a... Uh, before our school starts, we are going to start a Zoom class. In that, I am going to see your faces. I am going to talk to you and I am going to ask you some questions and you are supposed to answer, okay? And all the other subjects, all the notebooks, you should do or touch those notebooks, do something or write something in that notebook only when I tell you, okay? And all your homeworks should be done in your classwork itself. If I tell you to complete your classwork, my dear children, look at the WhatsApp, WhatsApp group every day. Every day I'll be sending you one page of handwriting, neat handwriting, and one page of uh, one or two pages in maths classwork. You should complete that. Look at that WhatsApp, what I'm sending, and write it according to that. The first page, your name and your standard name of the school and uh, name or uh, subject the notebook whatever the subject you are writing that one and you should know how to say i am and you say your name i am studying in second standard a section uh, or a1 okay and then you should say uh, this is my maths notebook and i am going to write in my class work. So you should look at that uh, uh, index also. Index page write the date properly and write all the details very properly and I will be telling you every single day how to use your notebook. So dear children, you must look at the WhatsApp group what is coming every single day. Don't worry if it comes in the night you can even do it next day. Do not cry or do not uh, uh, make a big uh, fuss. Okay? Do not trouble your parents. You can take it by yourself. Learn to draw the 2D shapes and 3D shapes. Practice in the practice notebook. I will tell you which is your practice notebook. Okay? And then you should uh, study the spellings that are given. Okay? I think I have already given you the spellings. Quickly shall we revise the spelling of uh, square? S Q U A R E square. These are the spellings, ten spellings. Okay, next C I R C L E circle. Next triangle T R I A N G L E triangle. Next rectangle R E C T A N G L E rectangle. Next is shapes S H A P E S shapes. Next is cone C O N E cone. Next is sphere S P H E R E sphere. Don't worry if you cannot follow me. I am too fast. No, no, don't worry. I am going to send you the same spellings in your WhatsApp. So you can uh, look at those spellings and note down in your classwork. Now it is time only for you to listen carefully and understand. Writing you do only after you see the video and uh, then you go to your WhatsApp group 
and open the WhatsApp group and check all the spellings and write. Shall we quickly revise the two and three tables and then we are through with our class, okay? Say the tables. Come on, repeat with me. Start with zero. Two zeros are zero. Two ones are two. Two twos are four. Two threes are six. Two fours are eight. Two fives are ten. Two six are twelve. Two sevens are fourteen. Two eights are sixteen. Two nines are eighteen. Two tens are twenty. Next, three tables. Three zeros are zero. Three ones are three. Three twos are six. Three threes are nine. Three fours are twelve. Three fives are fifteen. Three six are eighteen. Three sevens are twenty-one. Three eights are twenty-four. Three nines are twenty-seven. Three tens are thirty. That's all. So easy. Clap, dance, jump, and learn the tables. Don't trouble your parents. Okay, children. With this, we come to the end of revision one for maths class and unit one. Okay. Revise all the spellings. Revise the tables and learn and be ready to come to school when the school reopens. Okay. Bye, bye, children. Take care. Thank you.